My name is Alex Cecilio. I'm a graphic artist, and I'm going to give you some tips on painting in Photoshop. So when you're painting, um, there's a couple things you're going to want to keep in mind. Um, what your brush, uh, what the opacity is. So if you're doing something that you want to look more watercolorish, um, you can change the opacity simply by clicking your paintbrush tool, and then up here it'll have your opacity. So I'm going to turn it down to 65 just to show you what I mean. Um, for that kind of like watercolory effect. And at first you're going to say, oh, that doesn't really look watercolory. But if you go over to right beneath your gradient or paint bucket tool, you'll have the blur tool. And if you hold down that button and you go down to the bottom to smudge tool, this is actually going to make it so that you, you can make your watercolor um, bits look a little more fluid and realistic. So um, now if you're looking to do more of, instead of watercolor, more of like an acrylic kind of thing, just turn your opacity all the way back up and then you'll have you know, your options to mess around with the paint. But um, another thing you can mess with is flow. And what this is actually going to do is it's going to make it so that your shape shows up, the shape of your brush shows up a little better. Um, and when you have that and the opacity down, it can give you a really nice kind of like watercolory, more of that watercolor look if you're, that's what you're looking for. My name is Alex, and these are tips for painting in Photoshop. Thank you.